Here we go, here we go. Now look. Check this out. In one mile, turn right onto Westwood Drive. We gonna talk some NBA real quick. I'm gonna talk some NBA. The San Antonio Spurs will be the most improved team in the league. Now, before all you clowns, for one, I hate the Spurs. I hate the San Antonio Spurs. But I'm going to tell you this. My feelings has nothing to do with what goes on on the court. So I'm going to tell you something straight up. They're going to be the most improved team. Now, again, for you idiots, I know a lot of you, oh, 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 you're dumb. They're not, I'm not saying they're going to make the playoffs. None of that in that tough West, but I'm talking about from a win percentage, win differential. They won 22 games last year. They're going to have the most improvement, most amount of added on wins to what they had last year. I got them winning 37. So that's going to be 15 more wins than they had last year. I don't think nobody in the league is going to have a 15 win differential like the Spurs. They could possibly have- At the next stop sign, turn right. And you know that's pending on Chris Paul being healthy because Chris Paul, uh, you know what I'm saying? Chris Paul is a, is a guy who I put in that LeBron James and Jimmy Butler category. Any team you put them on, they evaluate the team. Any team you put them on. But look at these teams before and after them. Phoenix ain't sniffed. Phoenix last year with Paul, got hurt we seen what they did phoenix ain't sniffed up been close to getting back to the finals since chris paul being out jimmy butler we seen him getting to miami how close he got them philly ain't been the same since out of since without him since they got close okay minnesota at the stop sign turn right onto westwood drive the timberwolves just had them a good season i'll give them that anthony edwards he's like that but prior to that timberwolves wasn't doing that Bron James, I don't even have to speak on him. Y'all know what teams do before and after him. So I'm going to say that the Spurs is going to have... At the next stop sign, turn right. The biggest increase in wins out of all the teams in the league. The Spurs. Uh, so that's my most improved team right there going to be the San Antonio Spurs. Like I said, that don't mean they're going to make the playoffs or none of that. I just think as far as to what they did last year, because they can only go up. And now you got a true leader with the, the, the mind of uh, Chris Paul, Greg Popovich, and even Wimby. Uh, At the stop sign, turn right onto Wildwood Drive. Wimby missed out on a good extra four or five points a game due to uh, uh, somebody, point guards not being able to find him on cuts and stuff like that. Chris Paul will make the passes. If it's one thing Paul gonna do, he gonna make them pass. In half a mile, turn left onto Winnebago Street. One thing Paul gonna do is make them passes. So that alone is going to help Wimby. Uh, you know what I'm saying? And then, um, you know what they did in the draft? Pieces they gonna add. Spurs gonna be a decent team. They got that Jeremy guy. They got some decent, some pieces over there they can work with. Uh, so I, I'm really liking what to see with the Spurs. That pick and roll with Paul and Wimby is going to be deadly. Uh, he got the perfect point guard. Even at age 42, I think he's 42. Whatever age he is, that's still a damn good pickup for them. So I like that. I like the Spurs to have the most increase in wins. Who do y'all think? Who y'all got uh, having the most increase? Turn left onto Winnebago Street. Then turn right onto Walnut Street. Biggest win differential from last season. Mine's the Spurs. Let me know what y'all think.